Welcome back everyone, we are in the Super Mario Bros. 3 Pacifist run, I'm Andrew, and this time we've got Michael. Say this hello. time you've got me and my microphone, which Ooh. is at level 69, so... Hey! -o. hey. Look at that. Look right, at this, that. This stage gave me so much trouble that I didn't actually complete the world, yeah. so... The rest of the series might just be me failing at this over and over again until I, I throw mean, the controller. I mean, that's what most of my streams fucking look like, so <laughs> yeah. you're in good company, bud. Uh, you are in uh, good company. So far, so... Oh, well, Oop. never mind. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're off to the fucking races. We are. Try this again. It's not a, it's not a race, guys. It's just me. Pacifism. It's just you and peace on Earth. It's just Earth. me and the world. Boop, boop. Just trying not to hurt so, nobody. Boop. Doing yeah. my thing. There ain't nothing wrong with that. So let me tell you a story, Michael. While tell I me a story. Uh, last night, <clears throat> I was going to record some Kingdom Hearts 3 with my mm -hmm. lovely wife. That's my beautiful. Lovely, lovely wife. She Love is that. slowly getting into the series. And by that, I mean uh -huh. she's not really interested in the series at all. Damn it. She's not inter this interested at all. Mm -hmm. But we got to the second Disney World. We played sure. for about... 45 minutes and uh -huh. I look over at her and she's already dozing off. We started recording this <laughs> at like, we started recording this at 8 o'clock in the, or no 7.30 at night and mm -hmm. she couldn't even make it to 8.30. Dang. Yeah. It's See, not, I yeah. was expecting the story to be convoluted but not oh, to be like... super convoluted. Not to be like dull. I, I Whenever I see like Kingdom Hearts uh, stuff. <laughs> I usually look at it like this looks oh, like shit. a good time, just not a time where I know what's going on. And it's sort of like a more dynamic and colorful Dark Souls. Because yeah, Dark it, Souls, I love the fucking thing, but half the time I have no fucking idea what's happening. Yeah, I gave up trying to understand the storyline. I finished it by my like, I finished the game like ages ago. Oh but, really? Yeah, I was I, I was a little di disappointed with the third game in the series. I've heard I've heard <laughs> a lot of people feeling disappointed, and partially like I would I would expect at least some of that, right? Because right. it's been awaited for so long. They'd have to do some really revolutionary shit mm -hmm. to like match what's leading up, what that's been leading up oh, to. Shit. Oh no! I know. Die. All right, had to do it. I don't know if I can complete this stage without killing him. But... You can. I believe in you. All right. It's fine. Um, obviously, if it becomes impossible to complete a stage, I have to. I will kill somebody. Mm -hmm. But that's it's only just like master. Forgive me. I must go out loud <laughs> this do. one time. Well, there's some stages, uh, particularly in like the desert, like World Two, where you mm -hmm. can't move on without like hitting a like a Koopa into some blocks because they're gonna they're gonna block your way otherwise. Right. It's not. It's uh, it's not a perfect challenge. Right. Well, that's that's oh, something I was oop. That's something I was wondering is mm -hmm. like is this something that other people have done before where they just have not killed anyone? Is it like is it is there precedent that it can be done or is it just why don't you try doing this? This and, was you know, me, can anyone um, do it? This was me saying, "I should try this." Uh, God damn it. <laughs> it was me uh taking a challenge that the Game Grumps had per pretty much perfected. Mm -hmm. and made it worse or actually made it easier because they had the no touch challenge where they couldn't do they couldn't hit any blocks they couldn't hit any coins or kill anybody oh. i'm just i'm just doing the baby route and just not killing anybody oh interesting otherwise i would lose my mind up in here did they up in here. accomplish it uh i do not know i don't know how far they got i know they had done it for quite some time then did it, gave up on it for a little bit, and then came back to it as they are wont to do. Yeah, they do do that a lot. Ah, damn it. Oof. Oof. You hate to see it. You hate to see it happen. I can very, I can very clearly get in there. I know I can do it. No, you're doing great. You know, it's just it's just a matter of progress, and sometimes you have good runs, sometimes you have not so good runs. Oh, yeah. I have a feeling that this entire episode is going to be not so good runs. Well, which is the name of a ska band that I just made up. Not so, oh, okay. Not so it's good great. runs. 
the not like, so good runs. We like to remind ourselves of bowel movements every time we listen to the trumpet. Mm. Mm. We like to remind ourselves of ska whenever we do a recording as well. Yeah, ska whenever we do ska, uh, ska recordings. <gasps> no! Oh my god, Dang. there's two of them now. Yeah, oh, I was just geez. saying. I was just thinking two, two old dots <laughs> instead of one. That's no good. Okay, this is going to be ridiculous. It's fine. I can do this. I just have to okay. Okay. do okay. some ballet. That's clearly what I got to do. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, just watching out. Just be careful. Just... Yeah. Man, the blanket does not help at all. <laughs> For those of you in the audience wondering what that sound is, Michael has birds. And, and hopefully, like, the <laughs> microphone settings are such that people are going to be like, what sounds? But I, <laughs> that's just like a dare to dream moment. Yeah. That fucking fire guy is really... Yeah, I uh, hate him really so much. Franken, your... Have you gotten past this before? No, this is like the... This is the stage that has broken me in the last in the last attempt. Oh, okay. Yeah. The stage like, that broke you psychologically. Okay, well... Yeah, that's why I'm here I, as your <laughs> emotional support. Uh, that's great. That's great, you know? Uh, my last emotional sport kept hitting on my wife during the recording, which which is fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was she also in the recording? Right. Uh, Chris, Christina was not in the recording. She's going to be in the... Oh, shit. She's probably going to be <laughs> in the next one. How did he... How, oh, was it, was it Ray? <laughs> oh, it was Ray, yeah. She kept oh, hitting that makes on, a lot of sense. She kept hitting on Christina constantly. <laughs> Makes like, a lot of well, sense. She kept hitting on her through me, which that's I've, what I was wondering. I've come is to expect. She's just like, "Hey, hey, is Christina behind you? Hey, Christina, <laughs> hi, you fine girl? <laughs> I want to do stuff to you. You should ditch this guy <laughs> and get with me. <laughs> Lose the hero, get with a wait, what? Lose, Lose the, zero. the hero, get with the zero. That's how I hit on people. <laughs> hey, oh, <damn> <laughs> dude, you're with. Is this guy bothering great. you? <laughs> Fuck him. Is this guy? Is this guy giving you like everything you need out of a relationship, and oh. like proper emotional support? And do you <laughs> envision a beautiful future with him? Well, then why don't you fucking ditch him? <laughs> I <laughs> offer nothing. Uh, the nice guy motif. I feel like you should be wearing a fedora when you say it. It's the, it's the opposite, though. Like, I just want to get as far away from that as possible. So it's just like, you know what? I was going to, like, do a bit on that. But then I realized that those are both things that people do. Like, yeah. some people are like, I'm a nice guy, my lady. I'm a beautiful gentleman. Oh, fuck. <laughs> and then there's like other people. Holy? Well, I'm switching around. So okay. one is like, I'm a nice guy. All right. I'm beautiful. Oh, and oh. I love poetry. And I have a gentle soul. And I'll treat you right. And then <laughs> as soon as people are like, sorry, no, thank you. It's like, well, I bet you're on everybody's cock then. <laughs> and then... <laughs> I like that he goes the from other side to Cockney as soon as she rejects yeah. him. Yeah. Well, the other side starts in Cockney, right? Oh, it's course. just like, hello, hello. I hate all of you. <laughs> I think women suck. And you like that because it makes me like a beautiful, good caveman. Yeah. <laughs> you love that shit. And <gasps> then, nope. Oh. And then when oh. they, when it doesn't work, then they're still basically exactly like that. And so like both ends of the spectrum are represented among shitheads and so i can't even do a bit i like there's no good bit for middle ground right right that uh, that is uh, that i understand yeah, yeah. kind of sucks flub dub my own words for a minute there oh. flub dub flub dub what is this rick and morty <laughs> <laughs> that's my that's my new thing for when i say something <laughs> that's a comedy <laughs> <laughs> Sounds kind of like the Sun Gun Zobi, which the audience is still going to be fucking confused oh, by. You know what? We should add just, like, inside joke lore and do, like, little uh, intro videos. <laughs> Patreon exclusives. Yeah. Uh, the Bomb Patreon Deer. exclusives. You can figure out what the fuck we're talking about in any <laughs> yeah. of our videos. And yep. I think that's a, that's a great idea. Yeah. It'll be like the Goodwill Heroes. Yeah, what? people was... love inscrutable <laughs> shit, and this is a legitimate thing. People they... love inscrutable shit. Absolutely. They especially love uh, 
<clears throat> inside jokes that they are not inside of. As exactly. Far as I'm exactly. Um, we got, you know, we got shirtless o'clock. We got lower the disco uh -huh. ball. We got lower so many ball. things. We got Danube. <laughs> oh my God. I haven't thought about the Danube in ages. To find <laughs> out what we're talking about, pay me $40. <laughs> Uh, not uh, him not the bombardiers when people come and visit us like in the actual house we're gonna play we're gonna play some some Doka oh yeah King definitely for the channel. it's King. gonna be amazing oh for sure for sure for sure for sure yeah so people can know god what it's been ages about. i really do want to introduce so who of like the bombardiers has actually played dokapon uh it would just be me and you i think oh shit Ooh, dang i saw that coming yeah um it's it's certain things you know how like there's certain points where it's just like you start the jump and you're like i didn't make it yeah <laughs> uh clearly it's very upsetting yeah so it's like just you, it you and me motion. and and christina i take it christina has not actually like, she hasn't no we there's we don't have a lot of friends in in where we live alabama that makes so sense really and also i imagine me. you want your marriage to last i do that is the general like i'd like it. this one to stick so we'll <laughs> stop until we can sort of diffuse the blame <laughs> and antagonism among yeah. some mm -hmm. other people who we don't mind losing as much yep that's that's the key you know people think mario hardy is bad for that shit <laughs> but it really isn't i feel like it's not as direct with the That's antagonism true. that you can bring. Plus, it's not as... Mario Party is, as random as it is, it's not as random as Dokemon, I believe. Right. But then again, I might just be waxing poetic about Dokemon Kingdom. You're That's not. It. Because that none of that rhymed. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> good point. Good point. Touche. But, um... No, I, I I do think that Dokopan is more malicious. If I may, like, sort of do an imitation of games journalism, Dokopan mm -hmm. Kingdom is the Dark Souls of Mario Party. <laughs> so it's like Skyrim with guns. It's Skyrim with guns, and yet yep. Dark Souls. Yep. Skyrim with guns is the Dark Souls of Skyrim. Of course, right? Obviously. Wait, who described what as Skyrim with guns? Uh, that would be Funhouse Adam Kovic. He used to be part of Inside Gaming and then joined, became Funhouse. And then it's a long story. And now they have Inside Gaming again. It's a it's a gaming news channel. He's, he's one of the funniest people I've ever actually seen on YouTube. But mostly because he's dead inside. And it's kind of hilarious. You know, for whatever reason... We fucking love that. We do. <clears throat> Donate to our Patreon, everybody. We're dead inside. Yeah. You'll pay us for that, right? We right. need funding. We absolutely need funding. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. <laughs> we need him to co-star in our, in our YouTube channel. Yes. You know, Terry Crews liked one of my tweets. I did not know that. That sounds amazing. But I mean, it was basically it. about people lying about Terry Crews, and I was like, y'all are dumb, and Terry <laughs> Crews liked it, and I was like, <laughs> I have pleased him! <laughs> well, that about does it for this episode of the Mario Brothers yes. Pacifist run. Uh, next time we do it, it it'll... Uh, I'll try to make it easier on myself. Will you? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do an experiment. Bye! Okay. Bye! <laughs>